Check out this time lapse of the way things look. OK, see how hazy and foggy it is. Now this is what it looked like as the morning went on, as if someone turned on a giant HEPA filter and please ignore the giant spider attacking the city. Yeah. He's just on the front of the camera. <laughs> but look at that clarifying. What a beautiful sight. If you can ignore the spider, it is just amazing what just about six hours can do from the morning until now. And now we are seeing blue skies and buildings again. Wow, I love looking at time lapses when they could show something like that. Pretty incredible. So we can thank this. This was our HEPA filter. It was just essentially a cold front that moved by and well, it took away the smoke and haze. Now, not everyone has uh, reaped the benefits of it yet. The southern side still has a little bit more time to go, but we should all get some clarity in our air soon enough. Better breathing as that front's going to take away the wildfire smoke in the air, but also the humidity knock back our temperatures a bit. This is going to be something else good. I'm so happy to deliver good news. So other than the temperatures up to around 80 degrees today, lower humidity tonight, you might actually be able to open the windows 50s outside of Chicago in Chicago. We're in the low 60s. That is going to be refreshing the lower humidity and you can save on the uh, air conditioner. Tomorrow, another beautiful day coming with lower humidity and no big problems with haze and smoke like we had this morning and even a little bit cooler lakeside. We should have a little bit of that lake influence. Now our next chance of rain does not arrive until later into the week. This is Thursday morning, so we've got our next system coming in to bring us a chance for rain and thunderstorms. So in other words, we get to have more than one day of dry weather before we get hit with the rain again. So maybe everyone's lawns can dry out. We can actually cut some grass and we can get one day of dry weather in before we're hit again and this doesn't look like it's going to be a massive event but still some rain coming at the least here. So here's your seven day forecast. We're talking about 80s uh, as we move through Tuesday, Wednesday. But again, this is going to be a little bit nicer. The lower humidity is coming down where instead of where we saw the dew point up into around 70 degrees, making it feel like you were just dripping wet as soon as you step outside. 50s is what it feels like, and that is uh, much, much nicer. Thursday, though, the humidity is coming back a bit. We're in the mid 80s, and there's our next chance for a few thunderstorms. Hey, it's still it's not an everyday thing right now. We're keeping Friday and Saturday fairly dry and seasonably nice 82 degrees some scattered thunderstorms coming our way as we move into Sunday.